and welcome to a new video. Today I will show you inside the stable and also some of our outdoor facilities. Come with me! <laughs> entry to the stable and if we go in here we have my tack room so here we have uh, saddle pads I like to keep it as organized as possible so I like to do it in colors and my groom also like that <laughs> and we have a lot of drawers where we have uh, bandage boots yeah everything necessary actually saddles we also have some saddles upstairs that we use every day we have uh, blankets, also like to keep them organized. Uh, more blankets in here. <laughs> we also have some equipments for jumping in here, but most is actually packed now because we're going on a show tomorrow, so you will see more about the details later. Here we have a clipping machine, studs when I jump on grass, and yeah, a lot of things and uh, here we have the bridles uh, this bridle hanger my uh, friend the friend of my dad built this actually he's a carpenter and we actually sat down did some uh, scratches and he actually come up with everything that is in this sack room so he's really good Our chilling room. So here we have coffee machine, tea and a small fridge. Always nice to have some extra food in the stable. And we have a couch. We love to sit here and just chill, sit on the computer, watch the arena, the horses that are in the paddock. So nice. Uh, if we go over this bridge, we have uh, a small office where you can sit and do some work you had to do on the computer so we're back at the entry and if we go in here we have the washing place we wash all the blankets and everything in here dryer places and yeah machines so now to the best part the stable we have 10 boxes up here and this is where I have all my horses. Uh, all of the horses are on shavings and they also have windows where they can look out and also windows where they can look into the stables. We have the rubber mats which is really nice especially for the winter and when it's wet outside because we never need to worry about them to slide or something like that. Uh, if we continue here, we have uh, two cross ties and one for the solarium. Now I will put in some pictures of how the sable looked like before. We've done a lot of changes or like everything has changed actually. It was a really old sable and we bought it for three years now and yeah you can see how it looked like and how the changes have been if we continue here we have the border here I make the plan for the whole week it's really smart and yeah I really like it we have some more tack here more of the things that we use every day so we don't need to go up and down to get everything if we continue in here, we also have a small bathroom, that's nice to have. <laughs> and if we open here, we have the feeding room or the kitchen for the horses. 
We like to keep it as clean as possible here and also really organized so we know what all the horses are getting and that we have enough food and everything like that. My groom loves to have it super organized as I told you. <laughs> so we have everything in buckets, so we have morning, lunch and then, then we have the evening food. But it's a really smart system when you have more horses. Here we also have some more place for, yeah, we can have medicines here or supplements, everything you need. And it continues down there. to show you more of our outdoor facilities. If we go in here, we have the barn. Here we have all of the hay, hay silage, and uh, the craft for the horses. We also like to keep it really clean in here. If we continue up here, we come to the walker. And uh, I always like to have my horses in the walker every morning. They go around 40 minutes and it's really nice for them. This walker is actually hand by, handmade by my dad. So thank you dad. <laughs> and it fits uh, four horses at the same time. So here we have the outdoor arena. It's 2260. And we have Phoebe Sand. It's really nice for the horses to jump on and I really like it. If we go over here, we'll find the paddocks. So here we have the paddocks. I love to have the system where we can close everything off. So if a horse gets loose, they cannot go too far. Quite nice size for the paddocks. They can go around but not run crazy. <laughs> and we have uh, 10 paddocks, so we have enough for each horses. They don't need to share, they have their own. And the buckets are electric, so in the winter the water will not get uh, frozen. So we love to have the horses outside as much as possible. Normally they're out for, uh, from 9 to 16 in the afternoon and they really love it. So this is everything I want to show you guys in this video, but I will have a part two where you will see the riding arena and the stable I have downstairs. Also a little bit from the fields and the area we have around there. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video. Bye!